Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to Scrap Mechanic. And today, I'm going to be building glass wheels on a car and t putting it through some trials against spud guns, maybe against some tape bots, and just seeing what it's like to drive around as your wheels inevitably deteriorate on your car. Now, this is inspired by the recent multiplayer video we did where we built glass cars uh, with normal wheels. This time I'm building a normal car, but with glass wheels. And in this video, we will answer the question of why don't we have glass wheels? Because I know it's a mystery to everyone and it's the question we're all asking ourselves as we watch this video. So um, we're gonna make this easy and I'm just gonna search for car in my uh, in my lift here. Now this is a nice car, but it's a little small for the glass wheels that I'm gonna wanna put on this thing. There we go. This one is a decent size. So let's go ahead and take off these wheels. And now I've got to build a glass wheel. Oh, you know what's interesting about the glass wheels, I'm just realizing. Not only is it going to be an issue if just the edges of the wheels start getting shot, but if one shot hits the center where it's attached, it's just going to disconnect the entire wheel. And the only thing is these wheel wells do not lend well to these glass wheels. Um, I need a lot more room than a normal wheel. All right, I think this is a good size for a glass wheel and to give myself a little bit more resilience, I'm actually gonna weld two layers of them together. And this way we could probably survive a little bit longer. All right, here we go. We have a glass wheel car now. Let's see, uh, let's see how it drives. Oh, turning isn't gonna be good with these wheels. These wheels are just too big, but oh, we're gonna roll with it. <laughs> get it? And we're rolling with, actually, this is not so bad. All right, let's try turning though. Oh, yep, see that's, that's a little bit of what I was afraid of right there, but we recover from it okay a little bit. Is Yeah, it's not the best. This isn't the best car, but I've had worse. I've had worse cars than this. All right, now it's time to build some fun spud gun obstacles. So I'm just gonna put these spud guns on a repeating circuit here that I can adjust the time. All right, here we go. So driving past this thing a couple of times should make things interesting. What do you guys think is gonna happen? First, uh, make sure I got it saved on a lift. I don't wanna make that mistake again. I've been making that mistake a lot. Not saving things on a lift before I uh, start destroying them. All right, here we go. <laughs> so I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna watch from this side and see what happens to our wheels. I don't know if this is gonna affect us much at all. Okay, yeah, we're starting to have a little bit of impact. Oh, look at this. It's actually pretty resilient. You know what? I think we're gonna need some more spud guns. Yeah, I think we're gonna need a little bit more than what we have right here. That's okay. That's what the lift is for. We can go ahead and cut this off from the ground and then put it on a lift and duplicate it a bunch of times. Actually, you know, what if I type in spud? There we go. How about that? This is, this is not gonna fare well if I put a couple of these down, huh? All right, let's see how this feels. I widened the wheel wells up to, oh no. Look at the back wheel. Oh, this is exactly what I was expecting. Yeah, so now I can turn a little bit without uh, as much interference thanks to widening out widening out the back wheel well. All right, let's uh, let's drive in this direction now and see what happens. I wonder if this I, I wonder if the tape bots are really even going to be able to do anything. Oh my How am I still somewhat of a smooth ride? All right, hold on. Let's calm down. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, these wheels got shredded by that. But once we get going, we we kind of, we're kind of going. Like this isn't a bad ride. All right, I'm just gonna go in this direction. Let's just see how this, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> there we go, there we go, that's, that's what I'm talking about right there. This is exactly what this video was made for. All right, let's look at these wheels. They're having a little bit of issues. Here, let's see if I can try to just, just work my way back into the line of fire here. Okay, I think I've completely lost my, yep, my uh, my back left wheel is completely gone. Oh, my my front, okay, now, now my front left wheel is completely gone and I'm just, I'm immobile now. Oh, and now my back right wheel is completely gone. And I don't think, I don't think I'm gonna be getting out of this one. Okay, I thought of a fun, look at all the glass blocks everywhere. I thought of a uh, fun variation on this experiment. I'm gonna drive as fast as I can directly at the cannons. And we're just gonna see how far I can make it. Can I make it all the way to the wall? I think I might be able to. Actually, I don't know. That's a lot of spuds coming directly at me. Let's see what happens. Here we go. 
Oh my goodness. I actually made it. I hit it. Surprisingly, my back left wheel, all of my other wheels are completely gone, but my back left wheel is completely unharmed. That was unexpected. Okay, now the next experiment, this one I'm really curious about because I don't know if the tape bots are going to hit my wheels that much because there's no way I can tell them just to target glass. Maybe they will though. I'm just, I'm just gonna have aggro creations on, but I'm not gonna have aggro character on. But my goal is going to be to try to kill as many tape bots as I can by running them over. So I actually have to use the vehicle to get rid of the tape bots. Meanwhile, the tape bots should be shooting at my vehicle and who knows? We're gonna see who gets who gets disabled first. Maybe I shouldn't be putting this many tape bots in here, but I'm probably gonna lag the game out with what I, all right, I'm just, let's just, let's go ahead and spawn in. All right, aggro is off, aggro creations is on. Let's go ahead and pop capsules and see if, see how many tape bots we can kill before we get disabled. There we go. Oh, it's actually not nearly as laggy as I was expecting it to be. Oh my, wait, what? I've already lost a wheel. <laughs> this is not going well. I can't, I've lost two wheel. I've lost three wheels. I, I thought I had a better chance than this. They've, they've already taken out all of my wheels. I really, really thought I had a better chance than that. Now, oh, my seat's gone now. They're destroying my vehicle. Can they destroy the concrete? No, they're just destroying the wedge blocks. Wow. They've eaten my car. They actually have eaten my car. They destroyed my lights. I can't believe this. Okay, we, you know, we need a little bit of a head start. Oh, what are you doing over here? We need a little bit of a head start. We're going to, uh, we're going to spawn outside of the circle of tape bots. And this time we're just going to drive at them from way over here. Before they, oh, they're all shooting at the glass blocks just left all over the ground. Look at that circle, that looks so cool. All right, we should be able to, I'm gonna increase my engine speed. Where's my engine? Yeah, we're increasing the engine speed to max. All right, here we go, this is our best chance here. I should be able to kill some right now. All right, we've ragdolled them, but we're not, what? How are they not dead? I feel like that was a pretty high speed hit there. All right, come on. There we go. All right, now we have a chance. <laughs> I don't know though. That's a lot of tape bots and I think I've only killed one so far. It seems like they don't kill themselves, but my wheels are pretty undamaged right now. They're doing way less, way less damage this time and I don't know why. They completely disabled me in the first attempt when I started in the middle of the mall. I think just because I had more tape bots shooting at me from all directions. Now they don't notice me until I'm already approaching them. Man, I'm gonna tell you right now though, glass wheel traction is absolutely terrible. There we go, we got another kill there. <laughs> We're just ragged up. Oh no, one of my wheels flew off. I didn't even notice it was rolling next to my vehicle. That's kind of epic. Yeah, see, I knew that that was gonna be an issue is them shooting the attachment point. This might be an exper- Oh, there goes another one. This might be an experiment where it's worth um, giving the center point an indestructible block. There's a tape bot in my car. There's a tape bot inside my car. There's, how did, my, how did the tape bot get in my car? Oh, okay, probably like that. But yeah, I might want to give the uh, the wheels an indestructible block for this experiment just so that they'll stay attached and they actually have to chew away at the outside of the wheel instead. Because it seems a little bit OP when they only need to hit those two blocks that are attached to the bearing. Oh, and my seat's gone now too, I forgot. I'm probably gonna also upgrade the seat as well when I do this. All right, hit him, hit him, get a kill. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's make these modifications and uh, see how we do. All right, here we go. We have a nice solid uh, attachment with our glass wheels. Let's go ahead and turn aggro creations back on and see how much better we survive now. We'll probably be able to survive a lot longer because they're not gonna be able to detach my wheels anymore. They're actually gonna have to take all of the, um, all of the glass off of the wheels instead. So we might be able to kill a decent amount here. Oh, unless they flip me over. What? What happened to my wheel? Did they do that? Wait, how? 
How did they detach? Oh, the pipe piece. The pipe pieces have a low durability. You know what? No, I'm starting over. That is an unfair. That that should not happen. That should not be able to happen at all. That was a complete fluke. We're gonna we're gonna continue with the with new car. We've healed. We've revived. There we go. Oh, I gotta. I forgot. I gotta. Uh, hold on. Slight disadvantage here, but it's only fair since I had to respawn. <laughs> but I had to turn my engines back up. Oh, I thought something fell out of my vehicle. Turns out it was just a tape bot head. All right, looks like we're doing okay now. The wheels, yeah, I, I, the glass wheels are just terrible for turning. They are really, really terrible for turning. But they're doing some significant damage already. Ooh. Okay. Uh, let me put myself back on a lift here. Don't worry, the damage, the damage remains. All right, there we go. Oh my goodness, look at these wheels. See, this is this is what I envisioned. This, oh, look at that wheel. This is exactly what I was imagining when I thought of glass wheels. Just half destroyed wheels, and you're still trying to make an effort to survive and drive around on these things. It's too bad um, Scrap Mechanic doesn't have any impact damage physics. Because how cool would it be to, like for the wheels to, to deteriorate just from the impact with the ground like you would kind of expect with normal glass wheels? Although, if they were really glass wheels, whoa! I think you'd expect them not to get slowly damaged, but just completely shatter at one point. They're either intact or they're completely shattered into pieces. Uh, not what we're seeing here where it's gradual damage. Although, you know, maybe the right type of like tempered glass or something could have results like these. I don't know. I'm not a glass physicist. Alright, how are we doing? By the looks of it, the right side is faring pretty well, but the left side, as you can see, the left side is really, really not doing well. But, and also, this vehicle is terrible at killing tape bots with ramming power. You know, let's just back up. We're just gonna go straight backwards. Oh man, that one tape bot was just, he was just gunning for my wheel. Whoa! <laughs> okay, I gotta put myself back on a lift again. Oh, I can hear all of the glass shards just breaking. Okay. All right, here's a good cluster right here. Oh, I'm just, I'm just getting knocked around now. I can't even drive straight. Man, look at those back wheels. Oh, these wheels are, I'm gonna get disabled soon. Or do you think I can drive on just the, uh, just the concrete centers of the wheels? Do you think this vehicle can still drive just based off of that? I kind of want to find out. I want to let these guys destroy as much as I can. Oh! Oh! They did it again! They took off one of the, uh, one of the pipe pieces. It took so much longer that time, but I just lost the wheel completely because of that. And I'm not gonna respawn this time because we're too far in. We're too committed. <laughs> I'm not waiting for them to do this amount of damage to my wheels again. I'm just gonna keep going as long as I can go. I think that's the point of this challenge, is drive for as long as you can until you can't drive anymore. And it's already starting to reach that stage. I cannot back up and turn around here. Come on, get in towards them. Get in, I'm, I'm not gonna hit like anything. I'm trying to turn towards these guys. Okay, here we go, straighten out. Straighten out, there we go, another tape bot down. Whoa, two barrel roll. Um, all right, gotta spawn myself back up here. There's the seat, there's the seat. They've already, they destroyed my passenger seat as well. Oh man, my back right, we, my back wheels are almost, they're, okay, all my wheels are pretty much almost nothing, but the back ones especially. Wow, look at, the, all right, let me stop for a second. Look at this, we, look at these wheels. Look at them. I can hardly, they're doing it. I can hardly drive right now. I can't go anywhere. I gotta be honest, the tape bots did better than I expected them to. I thought they would be focusing too much on my vehicle itself and like my seats maybe, but they did, they did exactly what I was hoping they would do to the glass wheels. All right, I really, I can't get any, I can't get any speed or momentum anymore. Like what are the chances I'm gonna kill a tape bot like this? Yeah, this is as fast as I can go. This is, this is the state of, this is the state of things right now. Oh, we got a kill. Look at, do I have one block? I have a single block left on my back left wheel. A single glass block. <gasps> oh, 
Oh, I have no more front wheels at all. And my back wheels are almost completely deteriorated now. So by the looks of it, the tape bots have finally won. I am officially disabled. Well, after this completely necessary and important scientific experiment that the world needed, I think I have determined that glass wheels are in fact a bad idea. And the reason being is that they break. But if it wasn't for my extensive scientific test here, then the world may have never known why we don't have glass wheels. So don't worry, I don't need any awards or anything. I don't need any like official recognition or, you know, accolades or praise or likes or anything like that. I, I just did it for the advancements of human knowledge. That's, that's really what this is all about here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this experiment. If you did, you'll probably enjoy some other stuff on the channel that you can find right here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.